Hello, everybody, and welcome to uh, me being the worst. Uh, we are back at it again on the subserver 1.18.2 edition because I um, am, am terrible and have not gone through all the builds on the 1.18 server prior to it being updated to the 1.19 server. So um, we're going to hit up those builds today and uh, <laughs> make sure to check out our sponsor who hosts the subserver Apex Hosting. Yeah, we, well, it was like the subs are technically MCPH, but Apex under the same umbrella, you know, the whole deal. Get 35% off your first month of server hosting by going to the link in the description, code Captain Sparkles, and uh, that'll go until the end of June. Then it'll go back to 25% off your first month of server hosting. But anyway, and uh, of course, if you are subscribed on Twitch or a member of the main channel on YouTube, you can join up into the Discord and uh, get on to this or the 1.19 sub server. All right. Thank you, Bridget and Flamey, for being present. We may now go and uh, check out some of the remaining builds in the queue. Very exciting. Okay, first build is a continuation of Offline Valley. There's a bunch of mini games here as well. I am being punched. Good news. Welcome to the Offline Valley Super Fun Activities Cave. In here, uh, there is a little sampling of Minecraft mini games, some harmless fun for all those who wish to visit. Current activities, Pennywhacker's Abode, Brock, Block Crawl Maze, <clears throat> Ice Boat Racing, cool, maybe train for uh, Twitch Rivals, F1 2023. I'm going to get so destroyed if I actually, if they if they let me into this thing, I'm going to be just dookied on. Uh, small train track to ride leisurely, beginner friendly cave parkour. This takes you out of the cave when finished, four in a row, Vance Castle, beginner friendly dropper, cactus, and thank you for visiting. Okie dokie. Well, let's go do ice boat racing. I want to go do ice boat racing or beginner friendly parkour. Maybe we'll warm up with some beginner friendly parkour with me in survival mode, eh? All right. It's going to be like so not beginner friendly because I'm going to like mess up due to my toggle sprint being on with short jumps. Yeah, look at that boat race. Yeah, dude, we got it. We do actually have to do some freaking practice. Get off the parkour. Okay. <laughs> Takes you out of here. Wow. Holy frick. All right. All right. We need a countdown. We need a countdown. Somebody count down in chat. Somebody count down in chat. In in server chat. Someone. Somebody do it. Somebody. Okay. Two. One. And it's lights out in Offline Valley. Oh, God, I'm bouncing off the walls. This is a narrow course. This is a real narrow course. Holy frick. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. God, this is not a good precursor for F1 2023 Twitch Rivals, is it now? Holy frick. Okay, we're sticking it. We gotta keep it together. Keep it together. A lot of blocks to bounce off. A lot of blocks to bounce. Oh, God, I fricked it. Kind of 360. Oh, I was gonna like 360 drift around the corner, but it didn't work. <sighs> come on, come on, keep it together, keep it together. Flawless, flawless, flawless. Oh, frick, I'm hitting the walls. Why am I? Ah, what am I doing? Bridge is gonna catch up. Keep it together. Okay, there we go. It's okay if we bounce off on like a an area where it's like I'm not gonna run into a wall afterwards, but here we freaking go. Oh, he's zooming. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now that's what I'm talking about, right? That's not what I'm talking about. But we were talking about it for a second. Come on. Yeah, a little flippy dippy, a little flippy dippy. How many laps are we doing? Like 70? Full F1, full F1 race here. Oh god, imagine if I went off the course. That would be so embarrassing. Wait. I'm gonna lap Bridget! I'm gonna lap Bridget! Bridget's getting lapped! I'm Max for stepping! Lapping the other competitors. <laughs> okay, I gotta hit this 360. There we go. That's more like it. That's how we do. That's how we do. Okay, I feel like we did. I feel like we did. That was three laps. That was three laps. We take this. We take this. I'm toxic. <laughs> I'm not toxic. I swear. Okay. A bouncy castle. This is good. This is what I came here for. Wee! 
Guys, this is so fun. These are the best mini games I've ever seen in my entire life. I've never bounced like I have before here. All right, who wants to cactus? We need knockback sticks. Anybody got some knockback sticks? That's not a knockback stick. That's just a wooden sword. It's supposed to be knockback sticky poos. These are just killing each other. Mm. Let me see. Slash give cow sparkles use stick. My wait, how do you do this? Minecraft no. Oh, I don't know how it works on the server. Um how do you give someone a knockback stick? Like yeet stick. Oh, okay. Well that might be like a little bit high in the knockback level, potentially. <laughs> that might be a little bit high. Mmm. That's gonna like launch someone to the other side of the cave. But uh you know what whatever works. Whatever works. Here we go, everybody. Well, the thing with cacti is you're supposed to have like a counter, right? That for like king of the hill, like who's stood in the center for longer. Um so like I don't I don't actually know how this is going to work cuz we have no plugin for counting the amount of time that someone has remained king of the hill. So otherwise like yeah. Well, I don't know, let's just go and do, or I guess we could have it just be until death. Um, but then our stuff is going to pop all over the place and be just an absolute mess. Ay, caramba. Alright, I guess we can just go armor off until death. Alright, it's armor off until death. That is the plan. Everybody take, take off everything. All right, here we go. Here we go. In three, uh, two, two, frick, two, one, go! Frick! No, Bridget! Don't hit each other. Hit each other for once. STOP GANGING UP ON ME! Ah, oh, balls. Balls! I'm gonna probably die here. Oh, shoot. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's gonna hurt! It's not good! It's not good! Bridget's so low, though! Oh, we did it! We did it, boys! Woo! Woo! Good round. Good round of cactus. I didn't even get- I wasn't even able to pick anything up because my inventory was so full, so it kind of worked out really well. GG's. He's so mean to his mods. I am kind of the worst for not getting on the sub server recently. Alright, Flamey is back to AFK. <laughs> Flamey's like, hey, this is going to be occupied there for a little while, so, uh, you know, I'll just, uh, just leave him be. Um, you beat me at boxing, too. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah it's good, because I, um, I, I feel good about beating Flamey on a trackpad. So, yeah, seven years ago today, I beat you at Smash at VidCon. That was seven years ago? Oh, God, I'm so old. <sighs> so anyway, is there anything else to check out in this area? Or um, have we mostly covered the stuff? I want to make sure that I can fit all the remaining builds into today's stream. <laughs> so uh, do you want to do the dropper? Oh, sure, I could do the dropper. Where's the dropper at? Show me to the dropper, and I will do it. Um, Daniel the Noob, thank you for the 28 months. Pretty cool, mate. Ah, little baby easy dropper. Okay. Little baby easy dropper, huh? Let's see. God, you kind of just have to, like, YOLO it, don't you? Oh, I died. I died. That was hard to see. Dang it. 
That's sad. Hold on, I'll get it the second time. Things kind of blend in, don't they? I feel like just right to the center. Oh, I died! Oh my god. I gotta set a home at the top. Well, yeah, obviously you could just like slowly work your way down by dropping onto the different ledges, but that's no fun. Um, set home dropper. Already exists. Okay. Turns out this isn't the first go. Frick. Home dropper. Why do you call this a baby easy dropper if I'm not getting it? There we go. Man, oh man. This is embarrassing. Okay, is there a not baby easy dropper? Is there a not baby easy dropper or did we do it? Did we do the do? Or is this like another layer up where you start from higher? It's like have, having different tees in golf, you know? We started the red tees and now we're gonna... Okay, this is just death. It's just a way to get people to suffocate. Oh, that's the... Oh, that's the uppies to get... Ah, got it. <laughs> I understand. Okay, well, I guess... Flamey, uh, when you're ready to take us to the next build... Oh, I'm allowed to do the parkour now? Is that right? Allowed to just do a little jumpy, jumpy dirt parkour. I'll do it until Flamey is ready. The next build is by Chorus Trilogy, who isn't able to be here. All right, well, shout out to Chorus Trilogy, even though they aren't able to be here. Look at me just crushing the parkour. Oh my god, he parkours. He parkours so hard. He parkours so hard. And I made it! Continue parkour. I guess it keeps going, but TP Flamey. Thank you, Offline Valley. All right, pretty cool. Do you have a book or anything to read or just kind of explore and check things out? What are this? Let's see if we can get like a big, a big view. Oh, I wonder if this like whole, th oh, I see. Oh, it's all kind of supposed to be like outlined. I see the idea was like a terraform outline or something and maybe, Maybe just weren't able to get to it before the server updated and stuff like that. But, yeah. Oh man, whole ring of pathification. Oh, it just goes around. I wanna... I wanna live at some kind of cool, crazy sci-fi campus, you know, where you have some walkway with a whole... this overhanging, like, glass window that just goes around some like crazy valley like this that overlooks a, a gorge with water at the bottom. You know? You should start a cult and then you can make your own sci-fi campus. Yeah? So like, I just say that for, for the small loan of a million dollars a person, then you can, you can achieve like m favoritism among me, the leader, and, like, you can help fund the sci-fi campus that you also live at yourself. Oh, look at this! Oh, go, oh, this is pretty cool looking inside. Oh, K. Artista drowned. That's unfortunate. Um, as long as my cult can be tax-exempt, oh, that'll be really huge, dude. That'll be like really, I would be able to save so much money if my cult is tax exempt. <laughs> um, I just gotta figure out how to make that happen, dude. There was a, there was a funny John Oliver segment once on like them making their own, um, like they made their own church or something and, uh, got a, got a tax, what, what was it? Our Lady of like tax exemption or something <laughs> that they made on the show. <laughs> Um, chill man, thank you for the sub. Much appreciate, dude. Um, <clears throat> dang, this part keeps going. This is pretty cool. This is oh, that's a lot of shulkies. Is this like? I wonder if this is where the work kind of like stopped. <laughs> this is like a full inventory of shulks. Dang. 
Well, then it keeps going this way. Man. Oh my god, this path. This path, like, freaking went. Were you gonna cover this whole thing? This is all gonna be, like, inside. Oh, and this is where the path stopped. And then turned into a strip mine. Gonna be a heck of a terraformation project. My goodness. Oh, chill man, that was your that was your contribution to the sci-fi camp campus. <clears throat> you think I could do like a one billion dollar um like sub goal on Twitch? And then the goal is that if I get to one billion dollars, I make sure that it becomes tax exempt so I can actually keep the one billion dollars and then I make a sci-fi campus. Um, that I have to find a location. It'd probably have to be in, like, Switzerland or something so that it can have the whole, like, in the side of a mountain overlooking some beautiful valley with a river flowing through it. Either that or I can buy the rights to the Grand Canyon. For a billion dollars, do you think I could buy the rights to the Grand Canyon and then, like, build into the side of the wall and, like, have the cool, like, glass window that just snakes along the Grand Canyon? You don't think I could do it for a billion dollars? It's a national park. Yeah, whatever, but like you don't think that a billion dollars could could buy it? <laughs> maybe maybe if multiply that by a thousand, you think that it would cost a trillion dollars to buy the Grand Canyon? That's pretty expensive, man. Pennsylvania Grand Canyon would be much cheaper. I'd have to look. I don't know if that would live up to our sci-fi campus requirements, dude. Well, but, like, you know, if it is, it's a national park, right? But that means that the government is, you know, it's, the government is spending tax dollars in order to run it. Which means, if I gave them, like, a billion dollars, then, then they would basically get money... And also not have to spend the tax money to keep maintaining it. So it would really be, it would be a financially smart <laughs> decision for them to give me the Grand Canyon. So that <laughs> I can just take it off their hands and build my sci-fi campus. <laughs> um, so, you know. Um, Alright. I think, anyway, I guess we basically... Basically saw the stuff here. This is pretty cool. Um, well, I hope everything was okay with, uh, you know, yeah, uh, uh, building this and why it stopped being built. Hopefully there wasn't any issues and stuff like that. Fell out of the water. How does that happen? What kind of death message is that? <laughs> Are you a fish? <laughs> huh. Um... K Chappy, thank you for the uh, five buckaroos hyper chat, dude. That's so awesome. Hello, it's Awakened Redstone. What's up, mate? All right, well, I guess, Flamey, whenever you're ready, we can go and check out the next one and continue our quest to get through all of the remaining stuff. Next up is Lol Father, dude. Let's go. All right. Big plays, everybody. Big plays. Ooh, wow. Oh my god, did you fill this entire thing with water? Holy frick. Holy frick. I gotta see this during the day. Oh wait, what the frick? What's behind it? Oh my god, it's even- Oh my god! I thought the first orb was big, but then I saw the next one. That's some huge balls. Bro, this looks like it's something that was made with world edit, but it's survival. How did you, how did you make these huge balls in survival mode? What in the world? I can't even screenshot this properly because like the chunks aren't gonna load in. Oh my god! Wait, is it open? Holy frick! Holy what the frick, dude? I, I can't get the whole thing in a screenshot. How do I do this? Can I- do I title this video Minecraft's Biggest Balls? Huge balls in Minecraft? <laughs> 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 uh, 
or Bridget's the inside of Bridget's head. Do it, no balls. Do it, lots of balls. Um. Oh my God, wait. I don't think that I can like increase. I probably can't increase the render distance and do any. Yeah, like it's just gonna like it's just gonna look like that because the render distance isn't gonna get any closer. I just this is all I can do. This is all I can do. How the frick did you fill this entire thing with lava? How did you even do that? How did you fill everything with lava? I don't understand. I don't understand how you filled the whole freaking thing. Uh, holy frick, dude. Yeah, is the, does the nether have any lava left? Oh no, wait, this is super sad. <laughs> Clearly what happened here is that this was done until the subserver uh, updated to uh, 1.19 is my guess. Man, the subserver updating to 1.19 really fricked up some big work in progresses. The amount of buckets though, dude. This is nutty. That's so much lava. Oh my god. Minecraft's biggest balls, bro. Holy heck. Six thousand lava buckets? Actually, I thought it would have been more, to be honest, so. Dang. Oh my god, wait, can I go into spectator and get- I don't know if there's anything inside. Okay, it's just big hollow balls. The nether is, yeah, the nether is missing all of its lava. Holy frick. And then, thank you for, you know, the purple and green balls. That was a good addition. Very good addition. Oh, and then just the ultimate flex ball. Just, you know, just you guys, I hope you I hope you appreciate that you live a life of luxury, all right? You really do. You all live lives of luxury. I guess this is going to create a new standard of people who are going to be like, "Jardon, you keep your villagers in freaking wooden uh, enclosures, okay? Don't you see Lolfather who keeps all the villagers inside of solid diamond block enclosures? Now that's how you treat your villagers properly and give them the proper credit for them helping you with mending books and stuff like that. That is a lot of chess. That is a lot of chess for balls. Oh my god, dude. Can I have some of this for hardcore? Jesus. Is there stuff in every chest? Not every chest, but... Oh my god. Bruh, that's a lot. Uh, 4.1 million blocks mined. <whistles> Whoo, bully. That's a lot of blocks. That's uh, a lot of blocks. I can't, I don't, have I even mined 4.1 million blocks in the entire history of my playing Minecraft? I couldn't tell you. That may actually be more blocks than I have literally ever mined, ever, in a million years. Well, maybe not a million years, because that'd be four blocks a year, which I think is a reasonable pace. Good lord. That is crazy. Yeah, you brought you bring new meaning to I came to dig, 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 dig. 
I'll build balls. Oh, so big, 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 big. Then build some more balls. Take a swig, 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 swig. <laughs> Whoa, that looks cool at night, though. Dang. Big balls at night. Gnarly. Sing the rest. Um I'll we'll 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 write uh you know, I do at some point for April Fools, I gotta do we can go inside the lava ball. Uh at some point for April Fools, I'll have to do TNT 2.0. Maybe we can rewrite it. Oh, oh, okay. That's why it's 6,000 thing blocks of lava. I was like, there is no way that thing solid is 6,000 blocks. That would be like millions of blocks. I get it now. Why I take back the night too? Maybe, maybe take back the night too. Too, yeah. Excuse me. Rake back the night, too. Whoa, this is trippy. This is trippy balls. Oh. Wow. That's kind of gnarly looking, though. Whee! What is down here? Just a place to chill and hang out, I guess. Huh. Crazy. Crazy. What have you what have you clipped? Balls so big. Starfishes can regrow their limbs. No, they can't, because there's no such thing as a starfish. SMH my head. How does this work? Are they on like glass or something? Oh, uh, yeah, you just got glass so it can poke through. That's pretty swick. Um, inside of the purple and green ball is nice. Is it nice? Are you sure that it's nice? Is that the proper word for it? Here he goes about jellyfish and star, star dish. <laughs> mm, would you say this is nice? Me, when I talk about star dish. <laughs> I've never eaten... I've never eaten Sea Star, so I can't really talk about Star Dish, honestly. <laughs> All right, well, I think we've seen some good balls here, dude. I think we've seen even maybe some like Pokemon kind of great balls. So. I guess we can move on to the next thing. I'm sorry, Lolfather, if the uh, situation that caused this to be not completed is that we did the subserver 1.19 upgrade. I guess that kind of fricked a lot of people over, but I guess there were some uh, lagorific issues with uh, some stuff on 1.18, so had to happen. What can you do? Next build is by Membo86, who also can't be here, but left a book to read. All right, let's go time day and TP to Flamey. Oh, introduction to my place. Please read. Hello, dearest visitors. Welcome to the home of Membo. And I have been on the server for about two months. Feel free to go around my base and explore, visit my beach, try my awesome minecart track, try my... What did I do? Oh, okay, it's not at me. Try my insane dropper. Sit on a bench and relax while enjoying the view. Try and most likely fail to find my secret spot. Read some poetry. Go spelunking in a cave. I have given you uh, many options, so the choice is yours. Whatever you do, please leave a review of my place in the review book. Thank you for coming. Sincerely yours, Membo. A haiku, as I call it. Mom and Dad in bed. Lots. <laughs> huh? <laughs> <What>? <laughs> uh, 
You wrote this about your own parents? Why did you write this about your own parents? Why? Who wants to think about this? I don't want to think about this. Nobody wants to. Why did you write a haiku about it? Why? I don't get it. Uh, <laughs> I shouldn't have read that. Why did you do this? Uh, no, um, I'm not reading any more poetry. I'm avoiding the poetry. Membo! What are you doing? Can I get a Men in Black Magic Memory Eraser, please? Oh my god. So, uh, okay, welcome to the- wow, it's like a roller coaster and a T-posing Enderman, and, um... <sighs> Wolfie, thank you for the 22 months. Love the content. Much appreciated. Murio off. Uh, thank you for the sub. Roller coaster is fun. Will it also erase my memory when I ride it? God, I hope so. Uh, so I guess here we go. Wait, is that part of it? I guess this must be part of the roller coaster. Is it? Nope. One diamond for copy of my haiku. You're charging people money for a copy of the haiku? You're charging people, um, money? M you're charging people money for this? Uh, wait, what is this for? This is Men in Black Mind Magic Memory Eraser. I'm clicking it, and my I, I'm stuffing it into my eyes, and my eyes are simply burning, but I still remember everything. Uh, okay. Well, I'm gonna sit on minecart and go for a ride. Here we go. Oh, frick. I'm going back now. Well, we're going the other way, I suppose. Wait, I did it wrong? Oops. Fixed. Uh, is it, does it start here? Over here. Oh. Oh, got it. I can't read, but do I go? How do I go? Oh, with the button. Oh, cool. And away we go. Oh my god. This is crazy. Sam with tw uh, 32 months of subage. Um, wait, get bow ready. Why do I need my bow? Huh? Flamey is screening the next build. Are you screening the next build so that it doesn't have someone talking about their parents like that? I'm not waiting. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing with my bow. I might. What the heck? Is this so that people can drown on your roller coaster? Oh, there's conduit power, I see. Growing up in Australia, Ben & Jerry's wasn't really a thing, but I've seen it more often in recent years. Um, these past few months, I've been wanting to try, uh, find your favorite flavor with no success for some reason. I want to see if salt and caramel core is as good as you claim. I don't think they offer that in, uh, in stores. Or, sorry, I don't think they offer that in, yeah, in the ice cream shops. It's more of a thing, because it's the way that it is structured inside of the carton. It's, it's kind of like a carton-specific thing. Um... It, maybe in the store they would have salted caramel, but salted caramel core would not be a thing in it in like the ice cream parlor Yeah Oh, it was for the oh is it for the glow squids was that what I was supposed to shoot? I don't want to like grief the build but Carton as opposed to like getting a scoop of ice cream in the in the shop you know, I don't know if you're talking, there's Ben and Jerry's like ice cream parlors you go into and they like get a scoop for you out of there, or if you're talking about the cartons inside of a grocery store. The salty caramel core exists as a carton in a grocery store, but it wouldn't exist in like the ice cream parlor that they're like serving you a scoop from. Oh, you're talking about grocery stores? Oh, okay. Then hopefully you'll find it someday because it's some good stuff. Oh. I got it! I did- Uh oh. Wait, did I want to do that? Hopefully I did it right. Whoa, dude, this is gnarly. That's a pretty cool roller coaster. 
Whee! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we going into the creeper. Straight into the face. Oh, God. Yikes. That's a heck of a dropper right there. Dang, bro. I can't read everything. I think these are credits for people who did things. Oh, up we go. Whee! And we circling. And we circling. And we grooming. Whose build is this? Membo. We just don't talk to Membo about parents. Are we almost back? Oh, and then finally, oh, and then finally we get to the part that I saw earlier on that like just the normal roller coaster portion. Whee! Dang, this is a, oh, whoa, 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 easy there. Don't make it look like I'm gonna die. Freaking Indiana Jones roller coaster. I'm at Disneyland. Dang, this thing keeps going. Did we make it? Did we make it? Oh, yeah, no, this is part of it too. This is really part of it. Whew. That was a heck of a ride, dude. That was a heck of a ride. Wowie zowie. Um, okay, what else have we got? So I, I feel like we covered a lot of stuff. Was it uh, like, an oh, it must be an Elytra course. I think that's what this is probably, yeah? Uh, follow the numbers from 1 to 21. You're allowed to land on the white concrete. Walk around at the halfway point only. Insane dropper at halfway point ring 11. Mmm, okie dokie. It's a lytra in time, folks. Here we go. I'm gonna slash set home elytra. I correctly did it. And here we go. And here we go. <laughs> Please don't splat. Please don't splat. Please don't splat. These are thick rings, bro. These are thick rings. Wait, where's, where the frick is? Where's the next one? Oh, it's down. It's down. It's down. Oh, that's always rough. That's always rough to do. Six. Is it up? Okay. Okay. Eight. Nine, ten. Oh, no! Frick! You got it, you got it. Oh, wait, there's a gnarly maze over there. Where is the next one? Where's the next one? Is it over here? Twelve. Oh, wait. Oh, it must be on top. This is the dropper, I guess. World's hardest dropper. Where do you drop though? Target. Wait, what? Huh? Oh, do you enter into the arms? You enter, oh, okay, I see, I see. You enter into the T-pose. Ah, uh, this makes more sense now. Oh, dro oh, I see now. Okay, so that's ring 11, but then drop her up here. Drop her up. I was, so I was at the, what the frick? What do you mean? Where am I supposed to go? It would probably be helpful if I read. So you need to land between the coordinates on the next sign so extremely hard as an idea but not impossible imagine with glass there is a chest one block above the water i just don't remember full health feather falling for protection something 
Well, it's hard to read because of the shaders. Um, that, if only they were all like that, they would be very easy to read. But uh, set home Elytra. Confirm to overwrite. Okay, let's see what happens here. Target. Wait, what? Oh, I see you do that. Ah, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. So you like... There's no way for me to know, though, unless I... Um... Unless I go into survival mode, I won't know if I did it properly. Um, but yeah, that's... I see. That's tricky. That's a tricky dick. Oh, I think I did it. I think if you hear the water, you probably got it. I'm gonna count it. I'm gonna count it. Slay, thank you, thank you. Okay, and away. Oh, frick, gotta go back to survival. And away we go. Don't hmm me, I did it. I did it. Because I am a dropper master. Those arrow things uh, confuse me more than <laughs> not having them. Because they're like pointed in a million different directions. I'm like, what do you want me to do? Wait, where's, oh, 19's over here. <laughs> that one's good. I feel like someone griefed and like rearranged the uh, arrows on those signs. <laughs> And we made it back. Never went through a le Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my goodness. Um, Long gone win, thank you for the 245 bits. Hey Jardun, coming to LA on Thursday. Any recommendations for a fancy restaurant to take my wife to? Man, how fancy we talking? How fancy we talking? Like, I, 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 cause I don't, I don't know. Like there's some, there are really, there's some real good, super duper good ones if you don't like if we're kind of talking like budget fancy fancy <laughs> um it says god lewis yeah but i don't like i don't know miss why is everyone saying go back to 11 don't go to 11 okay thank you bridget i'm listening to bridget because bridget is is all-knowing okay bridget's like super all-knowing so I don't know. I quite like a restaurant that's called Providence. It's very expensive, but it's very good. And so, like, if they have any availabilities, though, so. Um, yeah. That one's pretty good. So, anyway. I think we mostly, like, saw... Well, I didn't go inside the house. Let me go inside the house and kind of see what's up. What have we got in here? Oh, the villagers, they're all sleeping. Don't go in the basement? What do you mean? The basement looks fine. Oh, write reviews? I do need to write a review. Um, let's see. Not bank breaking, but you plan to dress up for it. Hmm. I don't know, there's a couple like Wolfgang Puck restaurants in um, Beverly Hills that are, that are pretty good. I like Cut. Cut's my favorite steakhouse. So if you want steak, Cut's pretty good for it. And um, there's also Spago. Spago's pretty good. They're pretty expensive. Not going to be as expensive as uh, Providence, though. So, I don't know. Those are options for you. Um. Anyway, let's... <laughs> go to in and out right near LAX and watch planes but dress up fancy. Yeah, you could dress up fancy and go to McDonald's or in and out That's also an option. Okay, so guest book. Um, okay, so I'm going to take the book. And which one is it? I don't know which one it is. Dear guest. Ah, here it is. Please do not sign this book. Um, so... I could have lived without the haiku, but the roller coaster was fun. Um, five out of five on Melp. 
Done. There we go. Cool. Um, cool. <laughs> Great review. <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Didn't, oh, I didn't put my name. It'll be an anonymous review. Anonymous five star, at five out of five. Every time you go to LA, you always make sure to go to the In-N-Out near LAX to watch the planes. Huh. Okay. Interesting. Should have been four out of five because of IQ. <laughs> um, all right. Well, let's go to the next build. We still got to squeeze in, I think, like two more in the next 20 minutes before we go to every single mod. All of them. Next build is by LiesJ68, who also cannot be here. Well, shout out to them. What is the haiku? You don't, you genuinely do not, like your curiosity in this one particular instance is going to actually be something you don't want to, like, I know there's a lot of things that are like, haha, you missed it in the stream earlier, but in this case, like you actually just don't want to read the haiku. I can basically promise you that you just don't want to. It's you're and you're like, what could what could he be what could he be alluding to that I wouldn't want to read? And, and then and then when you go and you look it up and you try to find it, you'll be like, I should have listened to him. I was he was actually in this one instance he was actually right about it not being something that I wanted to do. I you're only making it more appealing. I don't. I, I, I think you're not realizing that is the opposite of what I am trying to accomplish. I'm just trying to make it so you're not actually interested in in looking it up. Because you're like, well, it's probably something negative about you. It's probably someone making fun of you. And it's like, no, no, it's not. It's, it's a general thing that's going to cause you to think about something you don't want to think about. It's like, what is the one thing that you don't want to think about most? Well, hopefully you can't think of it because you don't want to think about it. And that that is what happened. So, anyway, what's going on over here? Is this like a block palette figuring out, oh, what would be good in order to make the house out of and stuff like that? The rest of it is worse. Does it actually get even worse? Oh my God. <laughs> How does that happen? Oh my God. It really does. What were they, why did they, why? Why did they, why did they want to do that? What what caused them to want to write that? <laughs> yes, you skimmed it after. Oh my god. Huh. Well. The world may never know. Hopefully the world will never know on a mass scale. Um, does this go uppies? Out of my way, sheeples. Wish I could erase it from my mind. Well, I'm glad that I did not get the full, the full effect. That is a, that's very good. Um, uh, Zodier, 34 months, Lego boss, 200 bits. Not gonna lie, that haiku had some good tea. Okay. Sure. This is, uh, this is cool, though. This is, like, what I need to do in order to make my hardcore Minecraft cherry house like spiced up you know I gotta I gotta keep in mind these little details in order to make it super swick super duper swick you have Thai tea right now it's good dude that does sound good I'd like some Thai tea that's awesome that's super awesome well, um, I don't know if there's anything more to this area beyond the house and the bridge and the beacon, but it is a nice house and bridge and beacon. And it gives me, like, inspiration for my Minecraft Hardcore 1.20 cherry house. It's kind of like, I guess it's, like, more apartment-y in that, like, this goes up to the second floor and this is, like, the first floor and they're kind of separate from each other, you know? So that, like, it's multifamily housing. Um, Stinky Danny, thank you for the sub. And Carter D with seven months of subbage. Pretty cool, dude. We asked you to make a second floor. Yeah, but, but... I thought it'd be, like, too complex for me to be able to handle. We'll see. I don't know, man. I don't know. 
Ah, uh, what what does the floor look like in here? I should look for floor inspiration. It just planks. Just wooden planks. Nothing too fancy. All right. Well, anyway, I guess we can move on to the next build, which is this. Bro's been playing Minecraft 10 years and the second floor is too complex. Excuse me, Bridget. I've been playing for 13 years. Flamey, is there one more build before, like, that's it for the thing? The last build of the 1.18 server are the Riddle Rooms by Shumel8. And then, guys, next time around, I will be able to get on the 1.19 sub server. No way. Whoa, this is cool. Welcome to the Riddle Rooms. Whoa, oh, this is pretty cool. Look, wow, this is some fancy Swicken stuff. Wow, that's pretty cool. That's pretty fancy looking. Okay. Signs for feedback. Ye, 9 out of 10 redstone is weird. <laughs> okay. Huh, locker room rules. Don't take any items with you. Food is allowed, don't break any blocks. You're free to take and use all items you find in the rooms. Don't take items from item frames or items lab. Before you leave, put all items in the provided shell key. If you're using Optifine, make sure that alternate blocks is on. Put all your items in the chest and protect it with a sign. This, I'm not gonna do this within, if this is like a puzzle map, I'm not gonna figure this out within 15 minutes. Throw an ender furl straight down the water so it floats in it, push the button and drop it. What? Search, so you search for hidden things in order to finish, you need to flick the lever behind the iron door in each room and put all the levers in the main room in the right position. A solution for the levers in the main room can be found behind. Bro, there is literally no chance that I am possibly doing this before all the mods. Uh, solution for the main levers in the main room it can be found behind the wooden doors. In the, feel free to message you. Don't know what to do. So I'm going to check out every room in the beginning. Uh. Okay, what is this about, like, throwing an ender pearl into the freaking thing? All right, well, go in with nothing in your inventory, they say. So, all right, I'm putting things in the locker room. Surely nobody will take anything from here. Cap. Okay, so I need an ender pearl, and then I throw it in the water so it floats? As in like this? Oh, we're doing like one of those fancy elevator dongers. And then it's gonna drop the trap door and then bring me back. Oh, there was already ender pearls. I've never actually done one of those before, but I guess that's to like be able to reset your position. And then where do I go to start? Don't take any items. Rotating is allowed. Um, put all your items. Okay, push the button and drop down. Ah, this button. Okie dokie, everybody. Well. Um, I, uh, I dropped down. I did it. Okay. Please put all items in this box before you leave. Uh, quit. <laughs> so I bet hitting quit takes you back to the thing. Um, what the frick? Okay, so hold on. 
So that's going to be the exit, I assume. Congrats, take yourself a trophy. Okay, so we have to solve different rooms. Interesting stuff. Uh... Okay. Thank goodness it's not actually 10 pages long. Otherwise, we were going to have problems. They told her a long time ago that there would be a lot of crying on this way and that she had to keep her head up so she wouldn't get lost. Another time has come on another d way she would follow the golden linings as fast as possible, she promised herself. Crying way keep her head keep head up up another way golden linings fast huh crying obsidian way keep head up golden linings maybe it's like crying obsidian head up golden linings uh and then there's buttons in here what do these do? Like, do they just illuminate? I'm in creative, ignore the food? No, I'm not in creative. I went into survival. What the frick? Uh, okay, I'm gonna go and... The shulker is to put things in, like, once you're done, I think. Um, do you have to brew a potion? Wait, what is this over here? I have to get in, I have to open this door and then flip another lever. Ay, 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 bro, this is gnarly. I don't even, I have no idea. So you can rotate, but you don't take items from the frames. It's like I have to fill the stuff from, it's a really good invisibility look for you, by the way. I found this tricky to do, says Jessa. Uh, huh. I don't know, oh. That feels like something that probably was supposed to be closed. I wonder if that was supposed to be closed coming in here. Hmm. Is it a parkour? Oh, frick. Oh, that's good. We're fine. We're fine. It must be a parkour thing to get up here. Um, where do I jump to next? Probably this. Balls. Oh, I balls it up. Oh no! It's okay, it's okay, we're good. You wonder if the redstone may be wonky? Hmm. It could be. Okay, we made it. So that is right down, left down. Huh. Huh. You know what I think we might do? Maybe we'll turn this into like a dedicated video as we're approaching the uh, one hour mark anyway we could make this like a dedicated thing which does mean that unfortunately it's not the next episode of subserve being on 1.19 but i don't know if someone wants to like check and make sure that the thing works just so that there's no like redstone that's messed up and then that way we'll know that it's operating properly when we get in next and then we can do a full focus until we finish it up with no time limit on the next one so may i don't think main channel no but we'll just make sure it's running properly and it can kind of be its own little puzzle video. So yeah, thank you everybody for tuning in. Um, make sure to like the video, subscribe to Captain Sparkles 2, follow on Twitch, and of course check out the sub server if you are sub slash member and, uh, and our sponsor, Apex Hosting, Captain Sparkles. All right, see you next time.